Well, Wednesdays are for community champions, and tonight's athlete you could call a golden community champion. Two weeks ago, we introduced you to Eastwood grad George Garcia and told you he would be representing the U.S. at the under-20 Pan American Games. Well, Garcia went on and won gold twice. And tonight, ABC 7's Rachel Phillips takes you to the track where Garcia stumbled upon his new passion. Community Champions, sponsored by Albertsons and the El Paso Community Foundation. George Garcia's journey to gold or number one didn't actually start here at Eastwood's track. Instead, it started with one of these in his hands right here at Trooper Gym. There's, there's no way you could have you could have read this story. As Garcia puts up a shot and it's good. George Garcia first picked up a basketball at four years old. He played three years of varsity with the Troopers, even helping them with their run to the Sweet 16 in 2020. Go, go, go. To help him achieve his goal of playing basketball at the collegiate level, Garcia stepped onto the track in his junior year. We always try to send our basketball players after, after um, basketball season, and we feel it helps them out for their athletic ability. By his senior year, without knowing it, he found a new future. We were just short one person there, like, let's just throw George in there. Garcia posted a 50 second split in his first ever 400 relay. Well, that was like striking gold. And boy, did they. Let's go, George! Even though Coach McLean and Garcia got that time down to a 48 9, he was still set on spending his future on the court. Until he wasn't. When did you make the decision? just focus on track and, and go and try and run track at college. About two weeks before I graduated. <laughs> Looking back now, what do you think about that decision? It's the best thing I've ever, I've ever done in my life. Uh, definitely one of the, the toughest decisions I had to make, uh, just cutting out basketball, but I, I don't regret anything and I'm, I'm glad I, I took the path I took. And what a path it's been. Garcia spent his freshman season running track at Lubbock Christian University, qualifying for both the NCAA Division II indoor and outdoor nationals and becoming a two-time All-American in Division II for the 400 and 400 relay. Garcia in four... His time at nationals earning him a spot on Team USA for the under-20 Pan American Games in Puerto Rico. George Garcia. I can't even say I've been dreaming of this my whole life. The 19-year-old ran in both the mixed and men's 400 relay last week, winning gold in both. Cloud 9 was when I placed at nationals for, for D2, but this is cloud 10. His split at the games, a 45-6, a whopping 3.3 second improvement off his best time as a trooper. That's just an advertisement for coaches at the high school level and even parents who tend to, you know, put their kid in one sport when they're five years old and they may be missing out an even bigger opportunity. It's crazy how it all worked out. From a basketball to a bat, George Garcia's life has been one heck of a race. And he's not even close to the back straight. Rachel Phillips, ABC7. And Garcia told us he wouldn't be here if, if it weren't for his coaches at Eastwood. He now has a few weeks break before he starts training again. And he told Rachel he's excited to just keep learning the sport and hopes soon he'll be representing the red, white, and blue again. And from one trooper to another, trooper clap to Mr. Garcia.